Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Amy the Cali Texan and we are back with another video. So today's a different type of video. Me and Ben have a lot of things to do today. So I thought we would just take you along for the ride, um, errands, different stores we wanna go to, Barnes and Noble, I know for sure, cause I have to pick up one of my books. And I just thought it'd be fun for you to come along on the adventure all day with us. All right, I will see you in a few minutes. You wanna say hi, Ben? Okay, he, he doesn't wanna say hi, guys, so, you know, just wave at him. All right, guys, first stop is the car wash. We love going to the car wash, and Frankie actually had someone detail the car, so the inside's really clean, but it did sprinkle this morning, so I just wanna drive through the car wash. Ben really likes the car washes anyways, so that is where we will be. Then the post office, Barnes and Nobles on my list. We got a lot of things to do. So stay tuned. All right, guys, we are here at our car wash. It's called Whitewater Express. And it's pretty cool because we pay, I think, $18 or $19 every month. And we can come unlimited as many times as we want. And it has like free vacuum, free um, car mat washing and um, like you can use their towels for free, you can use their um, their air blower, everything is free included with like your car wash. It's amazing because they don't charge extra for those things. And I know in California, you do your car wash and then many of them, not all of them, some had the free vacuum, but then you'd have to pay like the quarters, keep feeding it the quarters for the car wash. I mean for the vacuum sorry the car in front of me i don't know if it got stuck in there or something's wrong let me flip around the camera so you can see what's going on hi ben yeah something's going on oh there it goes okay um either way so i thought it was cool that all these things were included and so we pay 18 or 19 dollars every month and come it's not the cheapest one, but it's not the best deal either. Um, there's a better package that you pay more money that includes all the the high wax, the you know all the specialties. But we get the next one, like the middle one, and we love coming. Like it's like the galactic soap. Like it's so pretty and so fun, just like to come. So a lot of times when Ben's getting bored or we just want like a little family thing to do, we'll, we'll jump in the car and come to the car wash. I know it sounds silly, but the kids like it, me and Frankie like it, and then our car's clean, so, you know. <laughs> but it's pretty cool because with that pass, they like scan your license plate, but if you don't have that, like you're going to pay $18 for one car wash. So you might as well get the pass and come as many times as you want. Like sometimes it rains and it, the cars get dirty or I mean, whatever the case may be, you just drive through your little car wash. Funny story in California, Frankie was always the one to drive through the car wash. When I had my own car, I used to do the hand car wash where you pay like a dollar with quarters and you do it as fast as you can before your time runs out. So this one time in California, he told me, just go take the car wash, you can do it, it's fine. And I'm like, no, it's scary, what do I do? Guess what? Guess what happened, guys? I guess I didn't line up my tire with the track the correct way. And um, I literally got stuck in the car wash wasted the car wash like I didn't get my car wash and then the cars behind me were like honking they had to stop the whole thing for a while and then I was mad because I didn't get the car wash so I was so embarrassed I just drove out like true story guys true story that really happened but I will jump back on in a minute we're gonna go to the post office now all right guys we're at the post office we have a problem I don't know if I left the package at my house and didn't bring it, or if I left it on the roof of my car when I was strapping Ben in and his car seat, and then I drove off, 
or I went through the car wash with it on the top of my roof. <sighs> I gotta go find that package. Hopefully it's in my house. Hopefully. Is that funny to you? I don't have the house. Where's my box? Ours. Are you sure it's not on the car on top? Yours. It's on the roof? Yeah. Oh my gosh, did we drop it? No. I so dropped. this is not edited, guys. This is like a day in the life with Amy. And that stuff roof. like this happens. Let me know in the that comments. Roof. Have you guys ever left something on the top of your roof and then drove off and it fell off? Um, yeah, guys, how fun. Now I gotta go find my lost package. I will see you guys in a little bit, okay? All right, guys, we are here at the Goodwill. I just want to check it out real fast. There's this lady I follow on YouTube, and her name is Crazy Lamp Lady. Check her out. She's really cool, and she always does, like, Goodwill and thrift store hauls. And she knows like the artwork and the artist to look for. So she explains to you as she's um, going through the Goodwills and the thrift stores, which artist made that um, piece of art. And then she sells it on eBay. But she said that she found a, oh, this is so pretty. This is my first time wearing it, guys. Um, she found a bunch of Ray Dunn Easter stuff at the Goodwill, brand new. So I'm wondering, if I will get lucky as well. So stay tuned guys, here we go. So every time I come in, guys, I always check out the sign because it'll tell you what today's color is. And it's, I mean, if you come on Mondays, that's always the best day, 75% off. But today's Thursday, so it's 25% off, it's still a discount. And we're looking for blue. Okay guys, I decided to jump back on because look at this car, it's so cute. It looks like a girl Hot Wheel. Sorry guys, I'm amused by little things like that. Okay. All right guys, so we left the Goodwill right now. I had to cut off the camera because Ben kind of knows when I'm not paying attention to him when I'm filming and he likes to kind of act silly. So I scored, like this was Nike Sports Bra Central. I got like, I think, where's my receipt? Um, how many did we get? We got 11 Nike sports bras. Nike. And they were all $1.99. So literally 11 sports bras. I don't know if you guys can see it. It's a little, I don't know. For $23.70 with tax here in Texas. That's insane. Now, unfortunately, I don't think these sports bras will fit. But I plan to sell them on eBay because they were only $2 each and they're Nike. So I'm sure I can get like, even if I sell them as a bundle, I can make a quick buck. Because Nike, honestly, what I've learned on eBay, um, anything sports, athletic, like they go like this. Because in the regular stores, they cost a lot of money for the, the gym wear and the workout wear and nike for two dollars each guys yes so back to my story so i actually called my sister to see if she or my niece needed any because you know they're nike and um as i was talking to her ben literally was throwing sports bras everywhere all over the store he was throwing them out of my car down the aisle like it was crazy it was so embarrassing i'd go and pick up two and then he'd throw three more and i was literally chasing these sports bras down the aisles it was so embarrassing so i had to cut him off and cut the camera off so i could focus more on benji but yeah true story day in the life with amy and ben say hi ben no. he's getting a little tired but we have to go to barnes and noble now guys so we will see you there all right guys so i am actually driving back to my house real slow just to make sure that i don't see my package on the street somewhere <laughs> yeah mm, i can't write this stuff guys this stuff really happens to me on a, like a normal basis it just i'm sure it happens to you guys too 
Um, let me know down in the comments, have you ever left anything on your roof and drove away? I might have already said that too. Sometimes I forget and I repeat myself. But anyways, I hope you guys are having fun on this little adventure with us. Benji's sleeping back there. Um, yeah. Let me run into my house, see if my package is there. Hopefully it is. And then we have to go to Barnes & Noble. All right, guys, hold on. Guys, so we are in the woodlands. And this is like the nice part of town where all the fancy restaurants and shops are and it's fun just to walk around because it's gorgeous here like the it's not the woodlands it's the woodlands so this is like the nicest like part of town and um i picked up my book from barnes and noble the girl brought it out to me which was great because ben was sleeping but now he woke up and I've never been here, so I think we're going to get some lunch and explore the woodlands. And I will take you guys along with us, alright? So stay tuned. I want to show you this real fast. This is an Urban Outfitters, but look how cool their sign is. It's all 3D and popping out. Like, that is super cool. I just thought I'd mention that. Um, alright guys. Let's check out this brightly cool painted building it is so pretty you know i love the yellow guys but it's so cool so there's cheesecake factory pf tangs and we are gonna go eat at shake shack so i've only been in the one in new york and it was amazing so we're gonna try out the shake shack in the woodlands all right, here we go, guys. Look upstairs on that top part of the glass building. There's a carousel. And there's like the there's a patio, like outside seating. Right? Yeah. All right, here we go. Shake Shack, guys. Ben actually didn't want to go inside Shake Shack. He wanted to go inside the mall, so we're checking out the mall. And right when you walk in, is this pretty cool fish tank. That's pretty neat, huh? Look at this huge bird. It looks like Kevin from up. It's a big old statue of a bird. And then on the side, I believe it's a fish. Let's see. It looks like a koi fish. Pretty cool, huh? Alright. We have the Apple Store. It's always like really bright in there. Now we have Victoria's Secret, pretty and pink. What else? Oh, this is such a pretty. Okay. Let's see what else, guys. Gap. Just look where we ended up. Yeah. Me and Ben found the pet store with the puppies. Oh, cute, huh? Hi, good doggy. Mm hmm. Oh, these guys are just sleeping. Oh, cute. Nice. Hmm. Oh, good dog. Two hundred dollars off all puppies. So I wonder how much they are. Look at that cute little one. Oh my gosh, how fun! You like the doggies, Ben? The good dog. Huggy. 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 Ben, say hi. Huggy. Say hi, Ben. Huggy. Huggy. Let me know if you have any questions or want to interact with any of the dogs. Sure, thank you. No store guys OMG look at this Ben doesn't know what to do with himself cool huh Ben uh, no I'm just looking at it 
Nikki. Check out the little store. We got tons of cool things. Cool. If you guys like Ninjago, there is a promo for Lloyd's Quad Bike you get for spinning stuff in Ninjago. Alrighty. Cool. Thank Check you. Out the whole store. Thank you. What? So guys, we found a candy store. No, Ben. Not eat. No, you have to buy it first. Let's buy it first, okay? So it's so cool. No. There's candies everywhere. We have the chocolate wall and then the fruity wall. My trash. My trash. Uh, shopping baskets. Ben just doesn't know what to do with himself in here. Oh, look at the big gummy bear. You see the gummy bear? You see? It's all the sour candy. Wow, guys. Wow. I hope I'm not going too fast for you guys. There's a like candy everywhere. Okay, guys. I'm going to stop here so I can keep an eye on Ben. Alright, guys. So it's hard to get Ben out of the puppy store. It was hard to get him out of the candy store, but here we are outside. It's sprinkling a little bit, but it's okay. He's actually running around this grass area with these other kids, and he's having a ball. So they're just running around, and he enjoys his little freedom. I don't give him too much, but this is a big open grass area for kids to play, so why not? Go, Ben, run! And there he is, guys. Say hi, Ben! you like in a 360 over shot that has like Christmas lights right there it looks really pretty but um you know of course it's daytime so it's not on but you have like the nice cobblestone flooring and here you have it guys the Woodlands Mall there's my Barnes and Noble I went to All right, guys, so I hope you enjoyed this little tour, this little fun day out with me and Ben. And guess what? I found my package. My package was on my couch, so I recovered my package, and we are on our way home now. I'll probably have to mail that package out another day, maybe tomorrow. But thanks for coming along with us, guys. Give me a big thumbs up if you liked it. Leave me a comment. Share my video. Tell your friends. And I will see you guys on the next video. All right. Bye, guys.